This exercise is an American hip thrust. It's a limited range of motion hip thrust, which allows you to get your technique nailed with the pelvic tilt required for a good hip thrust technique. So what we're gonna do, set ourselves up. Now only this time, how this differs from a normal hip thrust. On a normal hip thrust, the bench is resting just below your shoulder blades. What I want you to do now is wiggle yourself up so the bench is resting at about mid back. What that is gonna do, it's gonna reduce the range of motion and it's gonna force you to only tilt the hips through the movement. So from this position, we stretch, rotate the hips and squeeze. Let the back arch, rotate the hips and squeeze. Let the back arch, rotate the hips. Keeping the weight in the heels, pressing up, big squeeze on those glutes, back down, press up. We're gonna go one more rep. Notice how I arch my back and then I rotate my pelvis underneath me to come back up. That is the American hip thrust. Remember the difference being the American hip thrust, the bench is resting lower to mid back. Normal hip thrust, bench is resting underneath your shoulder blades.